Good morning teachers, this is Mr. Boyd. In today's tech tip, I'm going to show you what happens to all that Google Docs and, and things that you post in Google Classroom when a student responds to them. So what you may not be aware of is that when a student responds to a an assignment in Google Classroom, that Google Classroom automatically creates a folder on your drive and stores that student work in the folder. So I'm going to show you right now where to find that. So I've opened up my Google Drive right here and you'll need to do the same thing. And then when you come down here you'll see a folder has been created called Classroom. Go ahead and open that folder. And if you'll look right here you'll notice that each of my classes have a separate folder. And the, all of those folders were created automatically when I created the Google Classroom uh, way back in August. So now when I open one of these folders, these are a list of the assignments that students responded to that I posted on Google Classroom. So let's take a look at one of the folders and see what's inside the folder. So when I open this folder, you'll notice that each student has a document with their name on it. And that's done automatically when the student clicks the button to open the document on Google Classroom. It automatically names it and stores it right here as soon as the student opens it. Now, if I want to review Alana Roberts' work, I can click on this. See the instructions on the document, and then I can review anything that she did on that document. Now you'll notice up here that there are some photos that are not attached to documents. These are photos that students uploaded outside of the document, but they're still tied to the assignment. And so I could even open those and review those as well. Teachers, I hope you find this helpful. Please let me know if you need other videos. Have a great day.